All right, since this is a little complicated, uh, I decided to remake a quick video to show you how to install all those mods. Um, okay, what you want to do first is go to uh, reshade.me. I'll put a link in the video. And go to the bottom and download reshade plus sweet effects 2.0. All right, and then after you do that, you know, I already downloaded mine, so you do that, go here, extract it to a folder with 7-zip or whatever you use, extract file, blah, blah, blah. go to folder. Um, and then uh, after you do that, double click on that, go to the reshade setup, click that, click yes. All right, and now you want to go select game, find Max Payne in its directory. If it's on Steam, it'll be in Steam Max, which is common, Max Payne 2. Um, double click on the uh, Max Payne 2 application. It won't automatically detect it because it's not a DirectX 8 game, so you gotta select uh, Direct 3D8. I mean, it is a Direct X8 game, so select that. And uh, you can click Run Max Payne, Run Max Payne 2 right now, but yeah, it's not. You don't need to. Um, so exit that because it's all good so that that's all done this stuff's done right here so moving on next step go to uh, the pain evolution download I'll link the I'll put this in the video description not description just in the video too. download it mine's already downloaded so uh, now extract this which I already did into this folder so open that, you see all these in here, now go to your Max Payne folder, alright, okay, so Max Payne folder like before, but this time you drag everything from this folder, from the mod, into here, copy here. Alright, shouldn't take too long. All right, there we go. And now uh, that's done. What you want to do is that leave this open your Max Payne 2 folder. Um, let's see what you want to do. Let's take. Uh, let's go to uh, Sweet Effects in your Max Payne 2 folder. It's a folder in there, and double click on that. Open it. You'll see there's a Sweet Effects file in here. Um, you want to delete that. And then I'm going to put a link in the video. Just click on that right now and it'll take you to download. And you put that link, the download that you get, you put it where that one was. Just like that. That's what... So those are like the presets I already ma have made. So they look exactly like the pictures. Um, and now, the very last thing you need to do is... Uh, what is it? What am I doing? <laughs> Oh, go to scripts and then go to um, I'm gonna put another link in the video the very last link and click on it now or whatever and download this which will uh, let me extract it really quick actually I don't need to extract it. I can just open it um, oh I didn't show you you so in max Payne 2 folder go to scripts and it'll be like this. Delete everything that's in there because these don't work. They're glitched. So you want to get this one from the official download I put. You go to scripts here. And you'll see three files in here. You want to delete this one. Or you don't even have to delete it. Just don't pick that one right there. Make sure it's only Max Payne 2 widescreen fix. And Max Payne 2 widescreen fix uh, ASI. So select both of those. copy there and what these do right here is make it so these fix the um, the widescreen bug basic like not bug but max Payne was only made for four three monitors back in the day the square monitors and monitors and uh, this makes it so it's widescreen and also I, I could just show you right here actually 
what it does is for this you can see like in game it makes it so you can either have it you can switch it so you can have it full screen like this or like this if you push F2 it changes it it's kind of nice because then you normally the game is like this but you can make it so it takes up the whole screen I mean, it's kind of a cool like feature uh, but yeah that's it you're good to go uh, Max Payne 2 also I need to mention that this also makes it so Max Payne 2 can run on modern systems because with like AMD I don't know if it's an AMD problem but I just assume it is it won't run on modern systems systems unless you do like these special tweaks and that reshade uh, reshade thing makes it so you can run Max Payne 2 on modern systems so now It'll launch right up. And there you go. And after you launch it though, make sure you select Paint Evolution, because that's the mod. Um, and there's nothing else to it. That's it's, like it's good to go. Should be good to go. Uh, Alright. Bye.